Well, welcome back to the continuing saga of the NFED half wave. We uh, gave up on trying to be able to uh, accommodate the 500 watts of power with the my antennas uh, antenna. So we got this um, this new auto transformer, as it's called. Let's see if I can get around here to the light. Uh, this is uh, made by Ballon Design. And it's a 55 to 1 Unan model 5513T, no, E, yeah, 55131E, Ballon Designs. And uh, it's rated for the kilowatt also, same power as the my antennas, but I was told that it should be able to handle the power. So we just put 135 feet of wire on it. Uh, no little funny coils or anything along the way. We're feeding it with RG8 mini coax here from the wire man. And um, this uh, is an inverted V configuration. And um, in order to, uh, to show how this thing is uh, installed, I'll have to pull it back up. I just let it down so that it can be seen from the ground but the uh, the end here is about 30 feet off the ground when I get it pulled up and the middle of the antenna is at about 55 feet and then the far end is at about 25 feet and uh, the SWR is um, on 80 meters it's the highest and it's about uh, two to one on 80 meters which is not no big deal for a tuner and then on uh, the higher bands they are all very very low matter of fact 40 and 30 and 20 are just flat and um, it's not a dummy load because it is outperforming the big doublet over here and uh, the big doublet is uh, 130 foot homebrew ladder line in the works and it's at uh, about 45 feet and it's actually in many matter of fact most cases outdoing it and there's no counterpoise here it's just coax going into the shack about 100 feet of RG8 mini foam uh, so I don't know I can't explain it anyway I'm going to hoist it back up and you all can take a look at it. We're back and this is the uh, Ballon Design. Unin. Hey up there. Okay, we zoomed in about four times. And that's about as good as I'm going to get it. Uh, there's the coax going down to the uh, workshop down here. But uh, let me back off here again. And um, it goes down to this fence. There's a rope coming down, and then it slants up here to the uh, unin, and then on up to this tree. It's about 55 feet high, and then it goes back down uh, that way. So it's not quite supported in the middle, but it's close enough. But anyway. Like I said, SWR is low, performance is up, and I have transmitted for uh, about an hour long QSO at 500 watts and have no sign of heating or SWR change. So I'm very happy with the, uh, with the unin.